Hey gang, AV here. Been a while since I posted something and I just got some stuff in the mail so I figured I'd do a uh, unboxing video. Uh, real quick before I get started, just because I have them out, I actually uh, painted my uh, Boss Fight Studio uh, skeleton figures. They were the basic blanks, uh, white skeletons. I painted them. You give them a little bit more detail and depth. I did like a, a charcoal acrylic paint with a lot of uh, a lot of water to actually just kind of brush on some uh, some detail to make the, the molded details pop. I think it turned out really well, and we painted the uh, the shield. I gotta say we, because my my wife did help me with some of the finer details on that thing. I need to get new glasses, so it was a little tough to to get in there and see it. But anyway, I think they turned out really well. Really well. I love these figures. I absolutely love them. And they're awesome. But yeah, these uh, these were all just plain white figures. I brushed on uh, details that like to, to make them look dirty and uh, more realistic. And I, uh, all the, uh, the, the, what you would call it, the armor and the, the weapons and all, they were just all a flat, um, gray color, like, uh, the inside of his shield, you can see it. That, that's what they all looked like originally. So I put all the, uh, added colors on them. Uh, they, they, they turned out awesome. But yeah, Boss Fight Studios, uh, the, the uh, Vitruvian Hacks, uh, basic skeleton blanks, and I got like a, a couple accessory packs, and that's how I did them. So if you feel uh, crafty, <laughs> have some paint laying around, maybe you guys should do the same thing. Uh, anyway, let me see if I can do this one-handed, I doubt it. There we go. That might work. Okay. I missed the days when I had a when I had my uh, HD camera and my uh, my tripod and my video editing software and I was able to make videos so all professional like those were the days I'm sure you guys remember <laughs> uh, we'll get back there again I promise all right so what's in here uh, right off the bat we got shipwreck modern shipwreck this is actually the same one I have on the bridge of my flag but I got another one so I can hopefully swap the head out make a different sailor. I just need to find a way to get these sailor caps so I can just make anybody a sailor. That'd be great. Anybody knows of a, uh, a third party, uh, you know, a, a 1 18th scale uh, customizable sailor cap that I could just glue onto uh, where I could find one. Let me know. Definitely be interested. But that's the uh, that's the modern shipwreck. One of them, anyway. And then I got two other vintage figures in here. Dr. Mindbender. I bought a lot years ago. Which had uh, his cape, his, uh, his uh, medical probe, or whatever the hell it is, and uh, the hose, and everything. I have everything for the figure except for the figure itself, so I got him. He's going to be complete now. And I got Roblox because the one I had uh, had a busted crotch. So now I got a good one. And these are nice too. They're not too loose or anything. Good figures. Nice. I'm going to give that guy a good review. 
very affordable price on them. So now the bigger box. What's in this box? You shall see. As long as I don't cut my hand doing this one handed. Not exactly the safest thing in the world. This is my Gerber knife. Very sharp. Alright. Here we are. Oh. Ooh. Ah. Nice. Nice. So we've got a Hyatt Toys. Alien Lurker, 118th scale, interchangeable hands, face hugger, opened egg down there, very nice, very nice. Looking forward to having these guys open. Very cool, very cool. Looks great. So I got three of them. One, two, three. And I got two Predator figures. I went and ordered these from their uh, Hiya Toys website in, I guess, Japan, China. I ordered it from them directly. It took forever for them to get here. As a matter of fact, they, I think they pawned the order off on a, uh, on a Amazon real re, uh, retailer. To fulfill the order for me but long story short uh i think they were only 20 bucks each when i went directly through them now i mean you try to order these from a place here in the states they're 35 hours and up sometimes so i mean i know big bad toy store actually has these for uh the predator figures for a reasonable price but still i saved quite a bit of money by going there as long as i was patient to get them you know anyway so we got the uh, the City Hunter Predator from Predator 2. Believe it or not, I saw Predator 2 first. And I saw Predator years later. Predator 2 was on HBO constantly when I was a kid, so that's how I saw it. That's awesome. That's awesome. Again, 118th scale, so he's going to fit in with my Joes and my Doctor Who. <laughs> and my Marvel Universe figures. Good shit. And then there's this guy. Who's a lot more uh, red than I saw in his promo photos. That's alright. Very cool. This is the uh, Shadow Predator. In case you're curious. Very, very cool. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, gang. Well, that was my unboxing video. Got my Predator figures here. Got three aliens for them to hunt. Got skeletons. I got Joes. Doesn't get better than that, does it? So anyway, this has been AV. Um, I might actually make another video very soon. It was my birthday recently, and I uh, I got some stuff for my birthday I would like to show off. Uh, I got all that stuff downstairs right now. I, should, I was trying to keep it up here so I could make a video of it that way, but, you know, I couldn't wait. I decided to <laughs> play with it, <laughs> so it's downstairs. Um, I'll make another video soon and show that stuff off for you too. But anyway, uh, if you like this video, check out my channel. If you like what you see there, then please subscribe and, you know, make sure you click that bell next to the subscription, uh, button because the, uh, that's how you actually get notified about my videos. I, I know there's been a lot of, uh, I've, I've been, I, I know I've ranted a couple times about how my subscribers aren't seeing my stuff. And sure enough, a few of my subscribers have talked to me and said, hey, 
you're not showing up on my news feed. I don't know what's going on. I, if it wasn't for your Facebook page, I would have no idea that you posted anything. Well, that's why. It's because they they put this thing now where it's not enough to be subscribed to somebody. Now you actually have to subscribe and then say, yeah, I do actually want to watch these things when he posts them. I want to be notified when he posts something. So make sure you click that bell. Ring that bell. It's next to the subscription word. That way we can... Uh, that way you can see my stuff when I post it. So anyway, uh, look for me on Facebook, uh, Twitter, and Instagram. Uh, this has been AV. I'll see you guys around.